we're going to change the air filter. So to start off with, we need to pull off the housing. Start with the little tube. So you're using two hands, one to lever it with the screwdriver and one to pull it at the same time. It becomes easier. That's it, and that's off. So we're going to remove the clamps to get a pair of pliers, squeeze it together, and then just clamp it out. So now we're going to undo this screw, it's a T30. Side, we're just going to unhook that. I'm going to lift it up. Almost it come out. It should only be held on at the back now. And then we're going to squeeze these two together and push it up at the same time. Once you've done that, just pull the whole thing up. And if you turn it around. Then you'll see where the screws are so we can get to the air filter. So we're going to undo the screws that are holding the housing together so we can get to the air filter. To do that we're going to remove nine screws. They're T25s. Just pull the to pull it out all the way it gets to a point where the bolt stays captive within the bottom part of the plastic piece you'll start to feel it when it gets a little bit tighter and that's it so this should separate now that's it and it shows us where the air filter is so you pull that out and get the new filter and place it in the right position now you can get the housing and place that back over it. And place that in position. Now we can start tightening up the bolts. Put them up, but they don't need to be too tight, like they're only going into plastic. Once you've done up all the bolts, then you're ready to fit it back on. So now we're going to get the air filter housing and we're going to line it back up into position. So start off with the clip over here. So once you've got that seat in position, then you can release the clamp. Next, you can reconnect this to put it on. There's a little tab at the back to push in. So you can reconnect this. And you've got the bolt at the front. And T30. Get it into position. And start doing it up. Very tight. 
tight. Then get this one, you can put that on. Then you can get your pliers. Squeeze it together. Once you put it in place, you can release it. in place nicely when you're done with that. If you enjoyed the video don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe if you want more.